to the video, make you groove, make you move to my play. Hey, hey. Do you guys remember this from the time I almost stepped on a snake? So this is how you make that mochi. It is now in season. First off, you start off with the rice, which is a staple in Japan. Then you move on to making fire. Um, there were two fires going on. One fire, you have yourself a pot of boiling water. On the next fire, you have three pots of rice and you steam this rice with the boiling water on the bottom pot and the other pots are filled with rice it cooks quickly because this is open fire next up you get into some hard labor it is not as easy as it looks but because i got to the gym i had to shine okay this was the time where i had to shine thank you bench presses Anyway, because of technology, you don't have to stick to so much hard labor. This was just for us, Gaijin, so we get into the mood of things, you know, do it for the culture. And the actual way that you do it with this little machine over here. So you put in the rice in there after it's cooked up and then it will pound this machine will pound and mix it up and just grind it into a sticky consistency look at that piping hot you move it from the machine into that little machine over there i know her hands are made out of steel man because she was just handling that hot rice like it's nothing anyway so you make some little balls using this machine and from there you just play with the dough in your hands slap it a bit make a circle ball thingy my jiggle with your hands look at that piping hot it is it was so hot you actually i actually had to take some breaks in between because it was just way too hot next up if you are a profession and you want the big mochi ball this is how you do it slip it in there as well and just wait and then this is how the professionals do it she was just shining okay she was just getting into it and then from there you leave the rice the mochi to dry up for a while for some reason i thought they were gonna cook it after this or do something to it but that was it that was it dry for a while and this is how we were having our mochi and that is her handling the mochi like it's nothing just look at how she's doing it that is experience okay we were having ours with daikon which is reddish so it was spicy and the other one was with soybean powder and this last one is anko with red beans that are sweet thank you guys for watching and a happy new year this is a new year celebration for japanese people and i hope to see you guys on my next video enjoy the rest of your 2022